Hello Pisces and welcome to my channel, Love and Wonders Tarot. This is your About Last Night reading where I take a look at your romantic situation and try to determine what's going on. Today I'm using a variety of tarot decks, so I will leave that information down in the description box. And as you can see, I've already meditated, shuffled, and pulled your cards. All my cards are red in the upright position, so let's get started, Pisces. Okay, Pisces, today this side represents you and this side represents your person. I have a card that represents the overall energy of your situation, and I have an advice card here for you. We're going to start with your overall energy. It is free yourself. It's time to take back control of your life. Okay, so are you too focused on someone? Are you too into someone? Is that feeling not being reciprocated? Why do you need to, get to take control? So we'll, we'll see what's going on. So in your recent past, you do have the Ace of Swords. So I do feel like this is about being focused on a particular person. This is um, probably a uh, fast movement. Maybe this uh, connection kind of got off to a very fast start. I feel like you are passionate about this person, okay? Uh, you like this person, you want to be with this person, you want to get to know this person, and you are very, very focused on this connection. Your person has the, in their um, energy, their recent past energy, they have the Knight of Wands. So I feel like this person um, is fun to be around, okay? This person, when you're around this person, it's a good time. Um, this person likes to party, could like to party, but regardless, this person... You know, they come around, it's very passionate. Maybe you have been intimate with this person. More than likely you have um, because it is the Knight of Wands. But the downside of the Knight of Wands is that it's hard to um, get them to settle down, okay? They're, um, they may be uh, in and out, okay? They come in, they come in like the knight in shining armor, okay? But they may not stay, stick around too long, okay? So you're, you're focused on this person. I feel like, you know, with this Eight of Swords, you're trying to find out a few things about this person because they don't um, uh, seem to want to commit, okay? The current energy for you right now is the King of Cups. So um, this is telling me that you are all in, okay? You like this person or you love this person. You've thought about it. And um, this is the person who you want to be with. The King of Cups is a loving, kind person, a loyal person, a generous person, a kind person. So I feel like that's just, this, you know, it represents you, Pisces. This could be Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. This does represent water signs. So I feel like this does represent you. And I feel like that's just the energy that you're in. You found a person that you're in love with. You want to be with this person. Okay. So in your person's current energy, they have the Two of Wands. So this is about not knowing which direction to take. Okay, the Two of Wands needs to get to the Three of Wands, which is the movement. But your person is still in the energy of the Two of Wands, which means they're trying to figure out what they want to do with this connection. They're not sure um, where to go in this connection. Do they want to commit? Um, do they have other options? That's just the energy that they're in, Pisces. Not really knowing which direction to take, trying to figure out what they want to do. Okay, right now in this connection. Um, in your near future position, you have the Empress. So I feel like this is going to be a connection that you want to work on. Okay. You're going to strive to work on a connection, build it. Uh, you, maybe you want a family with this person. I mean, this is a new beginning. So you do want to start a new beginning, a new relationship, um, a future with this person. Okay. You're willing to do whatever you need to do to be with this person. So this is in the near uh, future position. So I feel like regardless of what your person does, you're going to be there for your person. Okay. And, um, you know, you're going to want to start a new beginning with your person. Um, in your person's near future uh, position, they have the hermit. Okay. So that probably is explaining why you have this card. Free yourself. It's time to take back control of your life. Okay. Because I feel like you're pursuing this person and it's just not being reciprocated. In the near future, you have, your person has the Hermit card. So they're going to step away. They're going to, you know, disappear at times. And again, like I said, with this Knight of Wands in and out. So th this just uh, verifies and clarifies that. I feel like your person um, is going to, you know, ghost you at times. You're not going to be around. You're not going to be able to get a hold of this person. Um, so, which tells me with this Two of Wands, you're probably not going to commit. So yeah, that makes sense. That's why you have this card. Free yourself. It's time to take back control of your life. Like I said, in the near future for you, Pisces, you want to work on it, okay? 
you want to build something if you know if you can have kids you want to have a child with this person okay you're all in like i said the king of cups is someone who's loyal committed so um yeah that's what's going on you know so you are in love with someone who's just you know out there for the fun this person's not ready to commit and this person will continue to be in and out and this person in the near future is going to probably like ghost you for a while with that hermit card they're going to step back step away from this connection okay so your card your advice card is the king of pentacles so the king of pentacles is you know a family man or the king of pentacles is just like the queen of pentacles they're family people they work hard they take care of their family they are loyal okay and it's all about structure and building the future so i feel like your advice is just that you know maybe step away from the situation and work on something that's real start something that's stable the next card down i find interesting is um the world card and this is the second version of the world card in, from this deck and so this person has stepped away from what's secure and they step through that wreath and they're moving on okay to something that better serves this person so i feel like when I put these two cards together, this is move away from the situation because you deserve something better and it's waiting for you, okay? The bottom of the deck for you is uh, also the Knight of Wands. So I feel like, again, this is someone who is so fun to be around. You can't figure out why is it that this person doesn't want to stick around and be in a, in a relationship because when you're around this person, it's so much fun. If, if it's... Um, a sexual connection you know, the sex is wonderful you know, everything about this person is great the bottom of the deck for your person is the page of pentacles so this is young uh relationship this is starting something brand new so i feel like this kind of is represents your person a page a person who's not ready a person who doesn't have a lot and a person who will start um new connections you know now and, and again so I, I just don't feel like that person um is uh you know, going to be co uh, committed to this situation, to this connection, really focus on this hermit card, okay? They're going to step away. They're going to be ghosting you. That You're not going to be able to get a hold of them. They're not going to be picking up the phone, stuff like that. So yes, Pisces, free yourself. It's time to take back control of your life. Um, you know, don't let this person control the situation, control you. Um, you deserve something better, okay? With this King of Pentacles, you deserve stability and loyalty. And, you know, you can have uh, this Empress energy with someone else. Like I always like to say, my disclaimer is I don't judge on my channel. You love who you love. So this is just what I'm reading today. All right. So good luck with the situation, Pisces. I wish you the best of luck. And thank you for stopping by and watching my video. And have a wonderful day.